Hello queens and welcome back. It is Queen of Queen She Me and today I'm sharing with you guys my Sephora Play unboxing for the month of October. So if you guys are not familiar with Sephora Play, it is a monthly subscription service where you will receive five deluxe size samples. So yes, five deluxe size samples that you receive every month for $10 and with taxes and everything is $10.75 a month. That does include your shipping and handling and then it arrives to your door, I believe the second or third week of the month so you can cancel at any time but if you're wanting to know more definitely check the description box down below as well as my Sephora play unboxing playlist that I will also leave linked down below so you guys can see what I have received in my previous Sephora play boxes as well so got my box you guys and let me tell you guys we got some cute stuff this time and we also got a foundation that I will be sharing with you guys in a little bit but you guys know that every single month they send um this little pamphlet and then you always get a 50 point play card that you can take it to your local sephora and use when you make a purchase so yes that's how a lot of times i rack up on my sephora points and i am able to sample new products that i have either been wanting to try out and or just picking up products that i've used before and love so you guys this month this one is called complexion companion so that is the theme for the month and they were pretty much describing you know your whole day routine and pretty much washing your face and priming as well as how you can take care of your skin on the go so i love these little pamphlets and i always take the time out to read them once i get done filming so i can see what else they also include in the pamphlet to share with you guys and they also to share with you the products that you also receive each and every month inside of that pamphlet so definitely check it out if you want to know more and again you can visit www.sephora.com this for is more. so cute this one um says public display of complexion so i love the play on words that they have for this month for the sephora play box <laughs> subscription for the month of october and so we're just going to dig right into it and the first thing that i have is a face cream okay this is from skin laundry and this is their hydrating cream face wash it cleans hydrates and nourishes the skin and you guys this is a big old deluxe size sample and it just says that you apply a small amount onto your damp skin and massage for 30 to 60 seconds and remove with a washcloth or rinse with warm water and pat dry and you guys i'm loving the size of this package that we actually got you guys and i've heard of this brand before skin laundry but i have not used anything from them so i'm excited to actually have been able to get to get this this month and again this is their hydrating cream face wash and i'm all about face washes honestly um as long as the face wash the, is hydrating and it does cleanse my skin and pull out all the impurities from the day that's really what i'm looking for in a face wash so i cannot wait to try this out tonight after i take off this makeup if you guys are wondering yes i'm wearing my fenty beauty pro filter foundation in the shade 410 and i did use the moschino eye palette again with a with two other palettes so yeah i don't know why i just wanted to put on makeup today and i'm glad i did because i have really been loving the fenty beauty foundation so moving on along we actually got some custom enhancer drops from cover fx and this is in the shade moonlight and i've seen um, one of my favorite influencers online actually use this and I know a lot of people rave about it you simply apply it on before your um, makeup or I think some people actually mix it in with their foundation so it just really all depends so okay so I wanted to zoom you guys in a little bit yeah I was kind of far out this is the cover FX custom enhancer drops and this is in the shade moonlight and so I'm just going to simply apply some on the back of my hand here because I want to see how this actually does work Ooh, and y'all this is like bomb so i'm just gonna put a little line there and ooh, i hope you guys can see that yeah as you guys can see that like this is definitely like woman of color friendly i would definitely have put this in my makeup today but this would have to be used for like one of those days when i'm really going for like a glowy glowy look because i already go crazy with the actual highlight i just love highlight you guys i just love highlighting my face it's just like my favorite part of makeup it's not necessarily the foundation because i feel as long as i find my perfect shade i'm good but i actually have the cover fx custom enhancer drops i'm sorry in the shade moonlight i'm excited to try this out so this is a good amount and you really don't have to use a lot of it and i honestly wouldn't 
Um, I will probably use about three to four drops in my foundation and that will be it because this bad boy is like literally beaming. You will get all your life. So moving, oh God. So moving on along, we have a new perfume from Gucci and this is the Gucci Bloom scent that we got for October to actually sample and try out. And I already did go ahead and spray this in. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good. And I actually don't have anything on today. So let me just go ahead and use this on camera for you guys. So there we go. Cause I don't like to use a lot. Oh, this is so soft. It definitely does smell like roses. It has a definite floral scent. So if you're not a floral girl, this probably wouldn't be for you. This is a perfume. Again, this is the Gucci Bloom scent. And you guys, this is perfect for the fall, even for the winter months. But I really do like the scent. It's very light. It's very refreshing. Like, I'm glad I did just put that on because I didn't have anything on. So this is the Gucci Bloom. And this is what the actual full size looks like, you guys. It has like a cream neutral packaging and it says Gucci Bloom on the front. So the next item that I got is from the Sephora collection. And you guys know I love Sephora. I love anything that they come out with. I love their masks. I love their facial scrubs. I like their just anything. Like they just have a lot of awesome stuff. And I also have some eye makeup remover from them that I got last month, I think, or like month before last in my Sephora play box and I love it, you guys. It takes off all of your eye makeup. Like, back to this product. This is the Instant Moisture Cream and it's a hydro Hyaluric Acid Booster. So this cream would be perfect for those who are needing to actually brighten their face some or to actually just make sure that they don't have any breakouts because anything that has an acid to it is pretty much going to pretty much keep your skin looking bright as well as make sure that you don't have all those excessive breakouts as well. So I wonder how this would have actually worked with makeup but this is the package. This is what it looks like instant moisture plus cream i'm sorry you guys instant moisture plus cream and i like that um sephora actually does have a moisturizer and i haven't tried a moisturizer from sephora i have used their um i have used their acne clearing mask again i've used their sheet mask and i actually have some of those new masks that they have in the little actual pouches that say that they're up to four uses y'all i've used those things more than four times and they're not even halfway done so i'm going to actually just try this out on the back of my hand because i want to see how this actually does work so i actually was getting low on facial moisturizers because i was digging for a facial moisturizer this morning and thank god i had some so initially it does have a soft scent to it it's not strong so just be mindful of that if you're one of those girls who do not care for a moisturizer to have a fragrance to it it does have a light fragrance but not strong um it absorbs into the skin very nicely it smells like it smells like it may have aloe or something in it or vitamin e yeah vitamin e is what it smells like it's just very soft, but this is what it looks like. And as you guys can see, it just absorbs very nicely into my hand, into my skin. And with me being an oily girl, that's very important. It has to absorb into my skin quick. If it's one of those moisturizers where it just sits on my face, it just it just makes it for a complete disaster. I have to be mindful of that with having oily combination skin as well as cystic acne you have to be careful about which moisturizers you use because if you put too much on especially anything that's super duper hydrating it'll really make your skin very very oily and you just really don't want that so just keep that in mind but i like how this really does absorb into the skin very very quickly i like that so i can't wait to use that as well tonight um, in conjunction with the Skin Laundry Hydrating Cream Face Wash. Like, I'm very excited to try that. The next item I got is a foundation from Makeup Forever. And this is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD um, Invisible Cover Foundation. And I don't know if I ever told you guys this, but Makeup Forever was the first high-end foundation that I ever tried about maybe almost 10 years ago. Yeah, and I spent a I spent about a hundred something dollars and fell in love with them and you guys slowly but surely I think I might wind up revisiting them soon but right now I'm really feeling this Fenty foundation like no lie but um unfortunately they sent me the wrong shade um I actually could have went down a shade darker they sent me the shade Y445 and it's really I don't know it's, it's just too light so let me just swatch it on the back of my hand here for you guys 
because I actually did swatch this on my face and it was just too light so this is what the foundation looks like on the back of my hand again this is the shade number Y445 and it's it's not going to work and I don't believe that this does oxidize but yeah thank you so much for sending me the foundation but unfortunately I just will not be able to use it it's just the wrong shade but you guys i am familiar with their foundations i do like their foundations they really are buildable they really do give you that full coverage and it's a lightweight wear as well so yes even though i have not worn them in a while i am familiar with them all right and the last item that i have to share with you guys today from my sephora um october play box is the dr brent pores no more luminizer primer now this i have been wanting to try for a very long time but they only sell it in one size at sephora and it's like expensive i mean it's very expensive for a primer but i have seen so many makeup artists freelance makeup artists rave about this primer and when i saw this come this month in my october play box i was like lit i was like yes and i'm kind of upset that i forgot that i had it because i would have used it today with my makeup i mean like seriously but i know that this foundation is perfect for those who have oily skin just like myself or if you're one of those people who has an except an excessive oily t-zone meaning your forehead and down the bridge of your nose yes this would definitely be for you i know i've seen platinum d if you guys are not familiar nikki um she's the owner of platinum d she's a makeup artist you guys phenomenal phenomenal and yes she's black and i love watching her makeup tutorials because she has so many tips and tricks and this was one of her favorite ones that i have seen her use time and time again and she's an oily girl just like me and y'all i'm so happy that i've actually gotten this so i'm gonna have to try this this week because i gotta wash my makeup brushes but let me show you guys what this primer actually looks like so it's a cream shade primer as you guys can see and i just want to rub this in to see because it says pores no more and oh it kind of like fills in your pores in a sense and it's not greasy it's not greasy at all like look at that gone it's not greasy so yeah i'm definitely going to try this out and i do like dr brand i have used some of their um exfoliants that they have as a part of the skincare line and yes dr brand is one of those brands where it's a good investment it's a little bit pricier but well worth the money um yeah so i'm excited to try this so you guys i'm excited for what i received in my october play box this month um, the only thing that was the downsize was again the Makeup Forever Foundation. They sent me the shade again Y445. Y'all, I'm loving it. I'm definitely feeling this Gucci Bloom. It smells so freaking good. I wish y'all could smell it. It smells so good. So go into your local Sephora, try it out. Another good thing about the subscription, you guys, is that a lot of times they'll have the in-store events. And if you bring someone with you, like your friend, then your friend can also get a free play box from that month. Yeah, you guys, so I really did enjoy all the products that I received in my October play box for 2017. Unfortunately, again, the Makeup Forever foundation is the wrong shade. So I have to go into the store to actually get, you know, a match to see what my correct shade is. Um, but I am looking at the foundation and it does oxidize just a little bit, but not enough again for me to actually be able to work with so yeah i'm not trying to do all that i just want the foundation to actually work so you guys i hope you enjoyed what i received in my october play box this month let me know if you've already subscribed or are wanting to subscribe and if so i will leave a link down below it's not an affiliate link so don't worry about that it's just a link directly to this site so you can subscribe to as well for the upcoming november 2017 play box so you guys you never know what sephora is going to send out and this month i've got some new stuff that i'm excited to actually try out this week so if you have not done so already please make sure to subscribe down below turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when i upload new content here on my channel and yeah thanks so much for hanging out with me today queens and i will see you guys in my next upload bye you guys Mwah. <laughs>